Air Tracker 7 flew over a large encampment near Denver's Elitch Garden this afternoon. And for weeks now, dozens of immigrants have called that area right there home. Well, now the city is preparing to clear those streets and get those people into housing. Good evening. Glad you're with us this Wednesday evening. I'm Shannon Ogden. And I'm Micah Smith. Denver 7's Christian Lopez visited the encampment today and talked with families living there. Tonight, she has an update on how the city plans to help them. Time is running out for dozens of newcomers from Central and South America who have been living at this large encampment near Elitch Gardens. Most of them were packing up their belongings ahead of the city's cleanup Thursday. Marta Perdomo and her two kids still have a tent set up even though they haven't been living in it. Yo estoy en un albergue. Yo solamente voy a dormir. Even though she and her family got into a shelter earlier this month, she says she comes back to the encampment on a daily basis because her dog Kiara still sleeps here because she's not allowed in the shelter. So now that this is all getting cleared out on Thursday, she has nowhere to take her dog. She says giving Kiara away is not an option. No, es que no la quiero regalar. Ella es parte de la familia. Es como otra hija para mí. Ella no tiene la culpa. Ella no tiene es un animalito. Martha is hoping for a miracle to find a place to keep her. Que la fue mueve montaña y que esta situación me va a cambiar para el bien de mis hijos y para el bien mío. And help with all of the hardships she and her family are having to go through. In Denver, I'm Christian Lopez, Denver 7. And a spokesperson for the Denver Human uh, Human Services says the agency will do what it can to help Martha. And they also tell us that the people living at the encampment will be offered space at a congregate shelter. Three shelters that had been providing temporary housing to immigrants are now officially closed and another is set to close next week. The shelter closures were announced by the city of Denver as a part of an effort to save up to $60 million this year. Denver still faces a $120 million budget deficit brought on by an influx of immigrants over the past year and a half. Mayor Mike Johnston is expected to finalize a plan for more budget cuts next month.